Hi, uh, my name is Felix Rivera Petrie, and I've been an occupier since September 24, 2011. A while ago. Um, so I guess uh, you want me to talk about my experience with the, uh, how we end up here in Trinity. Yes, and also um, D17 and your participation on that day and what the results were. Okay, well, yeah, exactly. The same thing is actually what led us here, I guess, to begin with, because it was like studying as a visual. But back in that morning, December 17, 2011, I actually left my apartment with just the clothes I was wearing on my back, my computer bag, my phone, and that's it. And I never went back to the place I was living. I was on this SRO, which was really, really bad. And I would still prefer to be with the occupation, even during the park days. I would. Um, so I, I, that day was when I fi finally made a, a complete dove into the movement, so to speak, because I was now 24/7. And uh, that morning, my friend Sean Barry from Buckle, New York, was there with some of the people of the agency. And uh, we were looking at everything that was happening, and I was had no idea what was happening. As far as I knew, according to the GAs and spokes cancel, this was going to be a safe action, because supposedly Trinity was going to tell the police not to get us once we were in. And it seems very crazy, and it was this 10-foot uh, fence there, and all of a sudden these banners showed up, and they say, can you help us carry this banner? And when I walk over there, I, they place me right bef um, behind uh, uh, Bishop George Packard. And um, the banner was not a not a banner, but rather a ladder, ladder disguised as a banner. And so we departed from Duarte Park and around like few blocks up and around, sort of kind of like distracted the police. The police have no idea what we're doing. And at this point, it's like, this is totally crazy. And when the, I mean, we tried to choose a spot and it didn't work. And a second time, we just put the ladder there and quickly, uh, they say, let him go first, meaning George Packer or somebody. And then somebody pushed me right after. Um, there was um, another guy who went before me, but I was a third person jump, jumping after. Somebody told me, just make sure he's okay. I believe her name is uh, Athena Souls. She's also one of the people who's been back in the park. And um, so I, as I jump, I remember just like seeing his head like in between my feet as I landed. <laughs> and then I started dancing and it seemed like a, a hundred years. This is like an eternity being there. And it just happened, it was 10 minutes. And everybody thought it was like, it's so long. And everybody was so ecstatic about it. And yeah, the, show, the police showed up and that was over. Um, there's actually a great, great picture of my arrest on my Facebook in which I'm actually sitting like I'm right now and um, I'm like in a very serious of gesture giving uh, the last puff of cigarette because this guy's about to be handcuffed and he passed me the cigarette when, while he was being handcuffed. So I was giving his last puff of cigarette and a lot of people love this picture because it's like, I guess so full of humanity. All right.